Hello everybody, and welcome back to some more of The Binding of Isaac Rebirth. Let's continue, shall we? As you can see, another Isaac kill in the books, and uh, the Polaroid is slowly filling itself out. So, who do we play as this time? What, well, who was it last time? Who did we win as? We've already beaten Isaac as a Zazzle. It wasn't, it wasn't a Zazzle last time, was it? No, it was Lazarus is who it was. Could do another Eden run, we have 11 Eden tokens, but we need to finish off some Satan kills, I think. I really want to focus on Satan kills at this point. Um, the, the quicker we can get the Satan's ki Satan kills out of the way, the better. Uh, so we need an Isaac Satan kill, so we might as well pick up the Isaac and move on. I really want to do continue and push on playing as, uh, uh, beating Isaac as often as possible, but, uh, we do need the Satan kills, and we might as well get them out of the way. The more we put them off, the worse it's gonna be. So Capricorn is gonna be all stats up. That is a fantastic grab as item number one. Can't complain about that one. This room can suck my gigantic balls. I hate these flies, man. They're a huge pain in the dick. Not a fan at all. But we can move on and live without them. They are dead. And that's all that matters. All right. So these guys, looks like we're still not one-shotting the flies, even though all stats are up. Not a big deal. Wow, this guy is a uh, pain in the dick hole. But he dropped a pill. Come on, be good. Health up. Puberty. All right. Well, that's not a big deal. Doesn't do a whole lot. Oh, good. We're one-shotting the dinglets. I don't even know what these guys are called, man. Everything's a dingle except for these guys. These guys are dinglets. And that's kind of just what I've named them. I feel like that's, that's appropriate, though. The little poops. Could call them, like, uh, I don't know. I don't really know what else you can call them. Dinglets is basically the best thing ever. I enjoy that name greatly. There we go. All right. Uh, you know what? Let's go explore the rest of the floor. The more keys, the more bombs, all that good stuff we can get, the better off we'll be, you know, later on in the game. So exploring all the early floors is uh, suggested, I guess. Now, the I would check for the secret room over there, but the secret room on the first floor, as far as I understand, it works a little bit differently, and you won't, might not necessarily get it. Okay, we're gonna get uh, level basement one famine. Now, that's not a bad thing. Um, the earlier we fight the horsemen, the better, because if we're gonna end up fighting the horsemen, uh, hopefully we'll fight one on each floor, and we'll be able to get ourselves a full suite of either Meat Boy, or Bandage Girl. Now, we did get level 3 Bandage Girl finally, which was great. Uh, now, level 3 Bandage Girl basically acted like a Meat Boy, uh, except that she had Charming Tears. So, I'm totally cool with getting a Bandage Girl again, because the Charming Tears alone paid for that. But, looks like we're going to get a Cube of Meat. Totally fine with me. Let's move on with our lives, and uh, maybe we'll have get to fight uh, Pestilence, not in Basement 2, but uh, on Caves 1 or 2. So this is nice and easy floor. Okay, relax over there. A little bit of premature, explo uh, premature explosion. Unfortunately, we did not get anything in the pots that did blow up. No tinted rock, I'm not, so I'm not going to waste a bomb here. But we will indeed look for our secret room on this floor. And there is a tinted rock right there. Whoop. There, easy enough. Really? Oh, dumb damage. I get so mad at myself when I take that stupid damage. Can't help it. All right, we're going to try two bombs here. We're going to try one here and one here. Yeah, double success. And it's a chest and it's a troll bomb. But hey, we filled our health. Well, was that worth it, Mathis? No, no, it wasn't. But, you know, when you when you look for a secret room, you don't know it's not going to be worth it. You can't blame yourself, Mathis. Just pat yourself on the back and go on with your life, all right, bro? Getting mad at yourself, what's that gonna do? Nothing. Just gonna make you a little bit more mad. Alright. We'll go ahead and pop this. It's another tinted rock. Which is nice. Oh, another spirit another two spirit hearts. Game, you are too kind. You are much too kind. That will hopefully uh, almost guarantee ourselves a deal with the devil. Nothing here, but we do have the boss room over there. Could just go fight the boss room, but I want to go get to the item room first. I like to ensure that we're going to have the highest odds possible at just crushing the boss. I have complete confidence that I would be able to win that boss fight one way or another, but I want to, again, hedge my own bet. I want to make sure that there is no question that I will indeed win that fight. Okay, another worm. Oh, oh. I thought there was only going to be two worms there. Okay, one more. Oh, nope, not one more. All right. Oh, damn it. I can't take it. I had spirit heart damage, not red heart damage. That. I've had this. 
Concussive Tears. You know, I got this in the secret boss trap room for... Was it Lazarus that I did it for? It's kind of a cool item. I like it. Um, I wouldn't say it's an amazing item. But the ability to not, um, possibly confuse your enemies, you know, inflict the confuse status just by shooting them with tears, uh, is always welcome. Any passive tear effect I can get my hands on is one that I'm not going to really say no to. We got Monstro. Of course it's Monstro. I always fight Mon- There it is. There's that passive tear effect. I think he just kind of moves or just floats around. Like, I'm not- I honestly have no idea what it actually- does like I don't know if he just moves around like a big old idiot and doesn't quite know what's going on with his life uh, but he just moves around it does look like that monstro at least the boss fight he just kind of jumps around well no nope, he will shoot at me so I'm just assuming the movement is erratic but he'll still do his normal kind of stuff not that it matters this fight should be over momentarily what are we getting health upgrade good we could trade that away to a deal with the devil if we get something good oh Krampus fight I'll take a Krampus fight Lump of coal, Krampus' head, all that is welcome. Krampus' head is probably one of the best items in, in the game, if not the best spacebar item in the game. Gotta be careful. Things are going well so far. I love how, uh, I love how Krampus looks now. He looks a little bit more derpy, and I like it a lot. Okay, relax there, Krampy. Krampy McCramperson. Yeah, Krampus' head. I love Krampus' head. It's so good. All right, let's move on. Now, I don't think fighting Krampus and taking an item uh, counts against our deal with the angel. I don't think so. Now, keep in mind, that means I'm not sure. I'll take it. And the more we end up keeping spirit hearts to give ourselves a buffer, uh, the more likely it is that we're going to end up getting ourselves uh, a deal with the devil. So, either way, deal with the devil, deal with the angel, it all works for me. Getting this little Krampus head in early is awesome, too. I love it. You know what? And somehow we took damage from some of the easiest enemies in the game. That makes me a little bit sad. Okay. Because once again, Spelunker Boy still need it. Unfortunately, every time I play the caves, I take really dumb damage. Mama's Boy, Dark Boy, you know, whatever, Mathis. He got that a while ago. Spelunker Boy, oh, man. Now you're talking about a challenge. Oh, suddenly these guys are no longer one shots. So they have to get slightly harder the deeper in the forest we go. It's the only thing that makes sense. Otherwise, why would they not why would the little dingles not be one shot anymore? It's unfortunate that that has to be the case, Dingles. I thought you liked me, man. Alright. Moving on with our lives. Uh, oh, mubble tarts. One of the most annoying enemies in the game now. Really? You're still alive? Did I only hit you with two of those? I definitely hit you with three now and you're still kicking, which makes me sad. I hit you with four now. So, what will I, what, what am I pulling away from this particular room? We are in dire need of a damage up is what I'm getting. Damage up is desperately needed. Wow, we're, oh my god. Are we seriously not doing that much damage to them right now? Usually they go down in one or two shots. The fact that they're going down in three or four, that makes me sad. It's all right, though. I'll deal with it. I'm a man. I won't cry about it. I want to cry about it, but I won't cry about it. Uh, I kind of want to get that key, but one bomb, I'm not going to use it for that. Interesting room. Safer room than usual. All right. Nothing going on here. Just want to find the item room. Could go fight the boss. Not gonna. Uh, I would like to see if we get a damage up or something first. Uh, I don't think concussive shots are going to do anything against these guys. Unless they just don't fire when they're concussive. But Monstro did. Oh, Bob's brain. Um, Bob's brain. Do I want Bob's brain? Fuck it. I will take you, Bob's brain. I'm not entirely sure if I like you as an item. I've only had you once. But I can see how you're useful. Put it that way. Alright, let's go fight the boss. See what we got. Peep! Again, fucking Krampus' his head. It's so good. So good. The, uh, now, what are we gonna get? We did not get to deal with the devil. That actually makes me sad. But we did get a damage up, which is nice. 
Um, I'm gonna try and find the secret room. Quite possibly right here. It was not there. But we're gonna keep exploring because we need bombs, we need keys, and if we can get money, we can go to the shop. Always explore your surroundings. Bob's brain, here's the problem with Bob's brain that I'm having. He doesn't necessarily sh fire off on the very first shot. So sometimes I have to like fire a couple of times. I fully expect him a lot of the time to just kind of fire off. Oh, Jesus. I am not firing Bob's brain like that close. I'll take a lucky toe. Who would say no to the lucky toe? Ho, ho, ho. Who would say no to the lucky toe? Not I, not I. I need a bomb. I need a bomb, bomb, bomb. Up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh. All right, well. Come on. There we go, that's what I wanted to do. All right, puberty pill. Uh, destruction, now we've already learned that this destroys all the rocks in a room. So that's actually a pretty good find. Could throw a Bob's brain. Just gotta be a bit more thoughtful with Bob's brain. I don't think, you know, I, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say I don't think Bob's Bob's brain is a terrible item. What the fuck? Oh, that's Bob's brain appearing. I don't. I think if you're careful, I wouldn't say it's a game winner, uh, but I would say that it is better than a lot of items. I mean, it's a free bomb, kind of. Uh. What does Rebuy King get out of here? Nothing else in there really worth it. The bomb, how much was the bomb? Five cents, no. All right, we'll move on with our lives. Little upset we didn't get a deal with the devil. Was really hoping we were gonna get a deal with the devil there. But, oh well. All right, see, like I'm saying, Bob's brain is not firing off right there. So, I, didn't, I, don't, know, I don't know what to do about that. All right, Bob's brain, come on, show up, buddy. Waiting for you to come back, my friend. All right, there we go. How did that not hit? There we go. So this guy's gonna end up having to uh, be taken care of manually. Again, it does have that kind of nice distance shot thing that you can just do some good damage on. All right. Wow, spiders, seriously? Oh, Jesus. Oh my God, that got, ner that got nerve wracking very, very quickly. With the spider having getting gotten close like that. Nah, there's nothing I can do about that. I wasn't gonna fuck around with that room anymore than I had to. Was that a bad decision to use the item right then and there? Yeah, probably. But whatever, man. Alright, so they might be asking why I used Hell Jazz in this room. Uh, it looked like a very heavy mushroom room. So I figured that I might get some pills, and I lucked out. I also got a liberty cap out of it. So we're gonna end up switching the luck, the luck toe for the liberty cap. But not until we get the pills, because I don't think luck up actually affects the pills yet. I'm pretty convinced it doesn't affect pills anymore. But I don't know that for certain. So I'm gonna do it anyway. Well, that's luck down. So hopefully luck toe is gonna negate the issue. Speed down. Health down. Wow. I couldn't ask for a worse mix of pills. Holy crap, game. That was horrible. My health up is gone. Wow, that makes me so upset. That's terrible. We're gonna get, we're gonna get large, so we're gonna get two hearts, but we're gonna slow our asses down big time in the process. You know what? Bob's brain up in that hizzle. So if we can get a, get a, most of these guys gone and killed off before Bob's brain comes back. Never mind. Oh, surprised it didn't hit. Is this unknown? Bad trip, of course. Everything is bad on these pill in this pill rotation. Didn't know, didn't know why I thought you know maybe differently, but unfortunately, life hates me. Isaac just wants me to die. Oh, here we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Really? A chest for a smaller chest. Check it out. I'll take the spirit heart. Lame, but whatever. Mom's bottle of pills we didn't have the money for anyway. And there's the boss room. There we go. 
Well, this should be hopefully a quick fight with Trinkus' head. Yep, nice and quick. Safety pin is evil up and shot speed up and range up. Not bad. Let's get out of here. Not worth sticking around anymore. So we're going to go to the depth one, which is always nice. Oh, uh, Bob's brain. Yep. Of course. That was my own fault. I don't know why I expected that to actually work without getting hit. It's fine. I'm not going to worry about it. I can't get bad at my own poor decisions. I'll take the key. Now, we, if we come up against a boss fight, there's a very good chance I'll actually just fight the boss because Krampus' head. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Krampus' head will allow us to just win, essentially. Strength card. Really useful. Some health. That's actually very useful as well. Could really go for a speed up right now. I'm feeling a little bit slow. I'm feeling a little bit slow. Um, I figured that'd be an easier way to clear out the room. Whoa! Greed fight. Could actually pop the strength card for this, but I'm not gonna. I think I'm doing more than enough damage. Bob's head, man. Bob's brain, rather. There we go. Making me a little bit nervous. But dropped a lot of money. Actually, almost makes the shop worthwhile. There's the item room, which is nice. I can actually just throw Bob's brain in there. Oh, okay. There we go. And this will re this room will actually recharge the rest. Whoa! Of uh, Krampus's head, which is always a good. I'm gonna be able to go to the item room. Perfect. Too bad we don't have petrified poop. If we had petrified poop. I'd be able to do a little bit of. Uh, a poop farming in this room, but unfortunately the poop farming in the room is not going to provide us much anything else. What do you got for me? Shears. That is something I haven't seen in a long time. So shears, for what you, for those of you who uh, haven't seen this before, is a space bar item. But if I uh, hit it, I can fly for a room, and then my body acts like a meat boy. He will uh, walk around and do damage on his own without any need for direction. He'll just do his own thing for the floor. It's kind of a cool item. It's a generally kind of cool item. Um, it's an item I never hated getting in vanilla. Um, but it's also an item that didn't really win us any runs either. It's a good item, but it's not a game changer, I would say. Is, is the word I would use there. Right, so. Let's go ahead and throw a bomb brain down there. Finish him off. Can we? Oh, shit. This room sucks. I would use uh, Krampus's head here, but... I don't know if I want to waste it. One down. Oh, okay. Tyre, you gotta go first, my friend. Bob's brain's gotta be coming back soon. There it is. You know what? Fuck it. Just finish the room off. Kind of hoping the chariot was gonna allow us to uh, hit some of the rocks here. No such luck. Boss room's gotta be close. Yeah, there it is. Uh, I am not. Yeah, that's what I felt. I was like, I'm not sticking by those fires, man. Those fires, uh, the deep red fires fire off little hard shots. Wasn't going to risk it. Do we want to wait for Bob's brain, or do we just want to go fight? Eh, well, he's back, so let's just go fight. Gish! It's been a while since I fought Gish, like, properly. And he's almost dead, which is nice. So we can actually just go ahead and finish him off. Maybe we'll get a deal with the devil. So we should be getting, uh... Little Gish now. Little Gish is a great familiar. Little Gish, he, uh... Does he count? He's an orbital, I think. No, he's just next to you. And he fires off slowing shots. He's he's awesome. Alright, okay. Thanks for that, buddy. Spirit Heart, you know, can't really say no to that. And some friendly spiders. Thanks, Satan. I was really hoping you were going to hook me up, though. With, uh... What do you call it? With brimstone, I've still, still, not have got not gotten brimstone in this game properly. Only little brimstone. He's the only one. That's the secret room over there, right? Yep. So never mind. Not worth it. I almost, I almost went looking for the secret room, realizing, forgetting rather that I've already found the secret room. Now the super secret room, on the other hand, we could definitely take a look for. Uh, you might be wondering, Mathis, why are you still doing this right now? And the reason I'm actually still exploring is we have almost enough money to make the shop worth it. And I want to go there and uh, possibly, possibly 
uh, make a little bit of something, something. There's a key. We might go to it now no matter what with five keys and only the depths two left for key usage. I hate you, spider. Okay. Bob's brain is going to cause me, I think, many an issue on this, uh, in this room. Well, okay, Bob's brain, thank you. Here I am saying he's going to cause me issues, and he actually takes somebody out for me. He's going to return soon. Guys, you got to hurry up and die. Bob's brain is going to return soon. Bob's brain returning is not something you want, for that sake right there. Didn't know the little chub dudes could actually go ahead and blow up Bob's brain in mid mid run there. All right, we're almost enough. One more cent. This room needs to provide me one penny. Oh goodness. Oh, yep, there's nothing I can be able to do about that. I was in a bad spot. No matter which way I shot, Bob's brain was gonna cause me issues. Still doing all right though. And a heart. Now, do we want to risk our last spirit heart to go into the curse room? The answer is yes. Unfortunately, it was not worth it. But we can go ahead and fill up. And we can get out of here. Lard is, is killing my movement speed. Ugh. This is rough. Actually, you know what? Fires. Pay out. Ah, nice mini mush effect. I love Liberty Cap. If we can get the fires to pay out... We're gonna go in there anyway, and see what we can get. Come on, poop. Oh, it's just extra pill bet, extra pill holding. Not worth it. We'll hold on to the pennies just because we have one more floor of a shop. Oops. Oh, uh, and it could possibly end up paying off. But next floor, if there's nothing in the shop that we want, uh, or we don't get enough money to buy it, we will just donate the rest of the machine and hope that we will unlock something. Though I don't think. We're going to be unlocking anything. But who knows? Let's go. Depths 2 is a mom fight. Totally forgot about that. Arcade on the floor. There's also a good chance we could be fighting Greed on this floor, too. Which would be unfortunate. But there's our 15 cents. Oh, Demon Judgment. Oh, how I wish. Uh, I am tempted. See, we got the item room in. Uh, oh, that is E. coli. I don't like E. coli. E. coli is turn the enemy to poop if they touch you. Not a fantastic item, if I'm honest. Oh, whoa, whoa. Almost walked right into that. And there's a shop, so. Looking good so far. What do we got? That is, if I get hurt, I drop things. That is a knapsack or fanny pack or whatever. Nah. Not amazing. Well, not that it matters anymore. The donation machine jammed super early. Well, if we do pull up 15 cents, I guess I'll buy it now. I kind of just prioritize the donation machine over the fanny pack uh, because I do think it's a little bit worth it. It's worth a little bit more to get more things unlocked in the shop so items like that won't necessarily show up all the time. Not that it's a, it's a bad item necessarily. It's just I prioritize other things. There's, uh, there it is. Let's go grab it, and then we can go fight Mom, which is fantastic. Fanny pack filled with goodies, so who knows? Maybe it'll drop parts and stuff. It has the opportunity to heal us in a way, so that's kind of why I'm going to take it. Whoop. Oh, that's dumb damage. I'm full of dumb, dumb damage during mom, mom fights. I really am. I take a lot of bad damage during mom fights. Right, we, took, we actually hit her with Bob's brain there, which is great. Right. Oh, oh, oh. I kind of want to finish you off, mom. All right. Um, a little bit. Uh, there we go. Okay, a little bit nervous. We did not finish it fast enough to get the super secret room, which is unfortunate. Isaac's Fork's kind of pointless. I don't like it very much. Puberty, another shit item. Um, We'll take the heart, and we'll just go on down to the next floor, then. Not a bad mom's boss fight. Not a mom, uh, bad mom's fight at all. Now, we will use, I'd say, the world card in utero. We'll hold off to using it until then. 
I don't know. Oh, that's got to be a champion. I was like, I don't know why he's slowed already. He's not. He's just a champion. Here. Which is fine. Come on. There we go. And then now we'll just go over here. I don't like these guys. They're too tanky for me. Gut guys, super simple. But their their earlier version, their evolution. A little bit more of a pain in the ass. Let's pop this golden chest open. Is that Cricket's head? Yep, damage up. Absolutely, my friends. That's tempting. That's really tempting. Not gonna not going to Yeah, you know what? No, you know what? It's a boss fight though. And I kinda just wanna ignore it if I can. That was uh, almost really bad damage on my part. And then these little things, it's kind of annoying. We're doing really good damage right now. I cannot complain. Things are going kind of our way. So a Satan kill on Isaac is almost guaranteed. And we're going for the Satan kill. I, I, I'm I tempted to go for the Isaac kill too, but we're just going to go for the Satan kill. It's just easier. Okay. That's annoying. Bob's brain. Gotta be a dick. What? I hate these little worm things. I hate that they can pop up beneath you. That is so frustrating. All right, Bob's brain. You gotta fire off, my friend. There you go. See, Bob's brain. It's not that bad. <laughs> that was a really good use of Bob's brain. Mini mush. Mini mush effect in the boss room would be okay. Uh, anyway, mini mush effect in the boss room would be just a gift because we do so much damage that it would be uh, just it would be almost invaluable. All right, let's see if we can get those hearts. At least unlock the hearts, because we'll we'll end up coming back to these to heal up if we need it. No boss fight, but gurglings. Ah! I only have one fucking little area to go. Whew, that was freaking close. Up, oh, Dingle. Bob's brain's gonna take care of you, my friend. Oh God, you guys are the worst. At least we're one-shotting their little ones. Bob's brain, I don't need you to fire off here. Thank you. Really, no boss fight here. Okay. Slowed him down. Again, Gish is a really good item for that very reason. Still no boss fight. Let's see if we can get ourselves like a... a uh, a tinted rock or something. And there's the boss fight, and it looks like it's gonna be a double fight. All right. Well, that is unfortunate. It's gonna be a big room. Hopefully, it's like double pin or some bullshit. Mr. Fred. No idea what Mr. Fred is. I don't think I've actually fought this guy yet before. He looks like Harlequin Baby. Let's see if we can get him. Pops the brain in there. They do break free after a while. Noted. And last but not least, uh, we're gonna get a health up. Beautiful. And we can just kind of move on from this semi-charmed kind of life. Baby, baby. And we will use the world card. You know what? No, we won't use the world card. We're gonna use the world card on Satan's floor. If we can now. I was really hoping that that wasn't gonna happen. Thank you. Come on, Bob's brain, you gotta get in there, thank you. Making my life easier. One Bob's brain at a time. I'd be curious if there's a Bob's transformation in the game. I'm curious if there are new transformations at all in the game. People have speculated that there are, um, but there, we have not seen, I have, maybe, I, maybe other people have. I have not seen another transformation yet, but I'd be curious. I'd be very curious. <laughs> oh, this is a shitty room. Mom's hands, always annoying. We got at least three of them. We killed off two of them. Here we go. Whoa, there's four of them. That's annoying. So we took bad damage. Okay, I'm not quite sure what the fuck that was about. There's four of them. Yikes. That was real shitty. 
It's all right, we're alive. No, I'm gonna go ahead and do this. Cause I'm gonna go back and grab uh, this right here. Was it a waste of a key? Is it a waste of a key? You could say so. Does Mathis give a shit? No. Uh, this is unfortunate. Gotta keep moving. All right, Whew, that was close. Just gotta keep moving on those rooms and you'll be safe. Come on, give me something good. Yeah, I'll take it. Okay. Oh, shit. Two mega dudes. I uh, can't remember their names. Uh, Mr. Mega Maw, Mega Maw, Mega Man. I think it's Mega Maw. Because Mega Man would be silly. And we have Mini Mush, which is awesome. One down. Another one should be finished off very quickly. And they did, they spawned. Oh, yeah, I forgot to spawn those dudes. Come on, boss room. Anywhere. It's going to be an It Lives fight. Hopefully, with Krampus' head, it'll be a quick It Lives fight. Okay. Simple enough. And there it is. Come on. There we go. Uh, I will wait until Bob's brain comes back, uh, just in case. Actually, you know what? He'll be here soon. It's just it's too it's too good. Okay. Isaac. I wish I had uh, like nine volt or something. Woo! The slow the slow ability the slow thing fucked me up right there. All right. Yeah, that actually completely fucks me up a bit. We still should be able to win. Get an it lives kill. A couple of heals. Could leave. There's a couple of hearts that I'm going to go back and grab. And then we'll move on. And go fight Satan. And again, hopefully Satan's a nice, quick, easy kill. Perfect. Alright. Well, it lives is out of the way. Satan, I think, I would consider Satan... So almost went up to Isaac. Holy crap. I would consider Satan... A slightly easier boss fight. Alright, so that is that. It's a little bit of a walk. We know where the secret rooms are, though. Uh, the rocks are in the way. There we go. Let's go ahead and pop this open. Hopefully something really good is in there. Oh, Transcendence. That is a hell of a good grab. We float down here. That's awesome. Transcendence is straight up just uh, flying. It's great. Now, do I want to go one, two, three, one? It doesn't matter which one I go to. So we'll go here. That is a really... Oh, okay. That didn't open up the secret door. Really? That, that, that bomb did not open up the door, but that one did. Uh, the bomb flies. gotta be very careful with them they just do so much damage I can't risk it now we could one half a heart go in there if we get a heart then to heal ourselves I'll uh I'll do it really damn it suddenly okay well Satan fight let's do it go again could use I'm not going to could use the Krampus head here though it wouldn't be a bad it wouldn't be a bad usage of it but I like to use it for the second run okay uh, Bob's brain actually I might die here right, we're gonna die <laughs> we're not gonna get a Satan kill here Unfortunately. Smooth. Yep, there. Oh, oh, there it is. I was like, oh, it was a bomb flyer. I walked back into Satan. Not a good choice. Sucks. It sucks so bad, but we ended up getting a mom's heart kill. I don't know if that actually counts. Uh, yeah, it doesn't count. So we didn't get anything. No progress made, unfortunately. Uh, what was it? Was it was it Bob's brain or was it Lard that got us? Or was it just poor play? Oh, uh, well, you let me know in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, come back next time. More Isaac. And consider dropping a like. You support means the world to me. And as always, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.